During World War I, William Henry Johnson, just Henry to his friends, served in the 369th Infantry Regiment, a mostly African-American unit that earned the nickname the Harlem Hellfighters. In 1918, the 369th was loaned to the French Army, who were overjoyed at receiving reinforcements and gave the Hellfighters French helmets and rifles. On the night of May 14th, while on observation duty with fellow soldier Needham Roberts, Johnson heard rustling and the sound of barbed wire being snipped. The two came under almost immediate attack. Roberts was incapacitated by shrapnel, leaving Henry Johnson alone to fight off a German raiding party of 30 plus men. Johnson threw grenades until he ran out, he fired his rifle until it jammed, and he used the rifle like a club until the stock splintered. Johnson pulled out a bolo knife and kept on fighting, despite at this point having been shot, stabbed, punched, kicked, and shot some more. I'd have run away after a paper cut. The remaining Germans fled and French reinforcements saw that Johnson had single-handedly killed four Germans and wounded around two dozen others. He'd saved Needham Roberts' life, as well as countless other soldiers who otherwise would have been caught by the night raid unawares. And all this while sustaining 21 separate wounds. In 1918, France awarded Henry Johnson with a Croix de Guerre. He was the first American to ever receive this award. In 2015, Johnson was posthumously awarded the Medal of Honor by President Barack Obama. The least we can do is to say, we know who you are. We know what you did for us. We are forever grateful. Remember to hit the like, subscribe, and all notifications button. We post new videos all the time. We'll be releasing more one-minute hero videos leading up to Veterans Day.